Hello everyone. In today's explain why series, we are going to understand why sub endocardial part of the left ventricle is the most common site for myocardial infarction. Here LV I have represented as left ventricle. Usually it is the sub endocardial part which is getting the infarction very commonly. Let us try to understand the reason behind it. The reason behind it is because of its anatomical structure as well as some physiological factors. First thing is let us try to understand the anatomical factor. The outermost part is the epicardium, then comes the myocardium, then the innermost structure is our endocardium. This endocardium lies deep inside the heart and the blood supply usually comes from the outside to the interior. For example, it is coming like this and it innervates the interior parts. And whenever there is severe contraction of the cardiac muscle, these vessels are going to be contracted and this is the part which is supplied by it at the last. So, this part is going to get very very least amount of blood. So, there are more chances for the endocardial part to get myocardial infarction. And one more reason is there is higher oxygen consumption. It is said that the endocardial muscle consumes maximum oxygen because it is working maximally. And another reason is what is there inside? There is blood inside. So, whenever systole is happening, it is contracted this side also, it is contracted the other side also. The blood is also compressing as well as the contractile musculature is also compressing it. So, this region will have the least amount of blood supply during a systole and the chances of myocardial infarction is maximum in the sub endocardial region only. And now coming to the part why left ventricle rather the right ventricle. All of us know the left ventricular musculature is hypertrophied rather than the right ventricle. What is the reason? Because it has to pump against the high resistance that is the systemic circulation via the iota. So, the normally the musculature of the left ventricle is very huge. So, the chances of MI is also very common in the left ventricle and specifically the sub endocardial part and left ventricle has the major bulk of the muscle. So, the oxygen demand is also too high for the left ventricle. These are the reasons why sub endocardial infarctions are very common. I hope it is clear. Thank you for listening to the video. If you like the content, subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends. Thank you so much.